Hello YouTube, Lizbeth and Christine. Today is reasons 22, 23, and 24 why we love science. And if I'm seeming a little less peppy than usual, it's because I'm really tired and I've come down with a cold um, and I haven't gotten enough sleep because of um, being on in, in the cathedral yesterday for forever, so my stuffy nose and my exhaustedness may come across, but reason number 22 is science museums, because who doesn't love going to a science museum? I got to go to the Exploratorium in San Francisco, which is amazing because all of the things at the science museum are things you can touch, like it illustrates that, this was the one that I found fascinating, if you have a hot coil and a cold coil, and the hot coil isn't like really hot, it's just like, I won't burn you or anything. But then the cold coil is like, you know, like water, running cold water. So it's like nothing more than you would get from a sink water. Whatever. When both of them coil next to each other and you put your hands on it, you feel pain because your your receptors, your nerve endings get all confused by the hot and cold at the same time and they decide that it hurts. Um, so then reason number 23 is lightning. And I, I feel like I'm kind of lying here because I really hate lightning. I mean, I like looking at lightning and I think pictures of lightning are like fantastic, but I hate thunder. So lightning storms are just like, they don't get along with me. I would like to go hide under the bed with my stuffed animals when it's lightning and like that. So um, <laughs> that's a bit of a lie, but whatever. Lightning is really cool because no one quite knows exactly exactly why it happens, I think. The, they tell you that it's like charges in the clouds build up and charges in the ground build up and then um, the lightning is the uh, static electricity coming down. Like when you um, have a really fluffy blanket and it builds up a static charge and then you turn off the lights and you, uh, you can make sparks show up, which is really cool. And on that note, I'm going to make reason number 24, static electricity. Um, and I wish I had wintergreen lifesavers to show you this with because it's really super cool. But I did it in Girl Scouts when I was in like, I don't know, sixth grade. If you take the white uh, lifesavers, the wintergreen, whatever, and you go into a bathroom and turn out the lights so it's completely dark, but you can like have a mirror. So you don't really have to do this in the bathroom, but it's really cool in a bathroom. And you crunch on it it'll sparkle in your mouth because of the, um, you're breaking the bonds in the um, um, candy and it's really cool. So um, those are going to be my three reasons for today and then I'm going to go back to studying for my mechanics test and reading the Bible for my class at six o'clock. So and not sleeping because I, I can't afford to do that. <laughs> Christine, I'll see you on Friday. Bye. <laughs>